All right, well, we made it. It's the International Building Show out here in Vegas. I'm really excited to check out the show. There's going to be all types of tools, equipment for big kitchens and bathrooms that is going to help us out in remodeling bathrooms. So let's check out this show and see what's all new. So this is kind of overwhelming. There's like <laughs> literally thousands of people here. And it doesn't really pay to get here early because 9 o'clock is when they open. They won't even let you in. So... But holy cow, this is a big event. This is like coverings like 4.0. 4. Let's see what we got here. Holy cow. So this is the, I don't know if you can even see the sign up there, the Kohler, Kohler headquarters here. There's your soapstone. That is beautiful. Man, look at this kitchen. <laughs> look at, okay, so you wanted a, a kitchen that's secluded. Look at that. I love that idea. Oh, yeah, see, yeah, it is. So what, is this what you're wanting? Yeah. Something that's like its own little nook in here. <laughs> so this is, this is Sterling. So these are really DIY friendly showers. It's uh, basically a four piece unit. No caulking involved, very easy to install. But this is great for a DIYer to be able to install. I'm really excited to try one of these. These are all plastic. I mean, yeah. yep, that's the. Oh boy, look at this beauty. <laughs> it's about as cheap as it gets. It's got a. I got a steering wheel for your shower faucet, I guess, huh? I mean, that's a good safety bar. This is actually. This is actually pretty cool. Having a grab bar with your handheld. Huh, that is kind of an interesting that idea. It's really necessary. For yeah, no, it is. People. I agree. Yeah. And then, oh. huh. Nice. Yeah. So these, these uh, shower towers, are something very appealing. They're just, I mean, they're really easy to install for the most part, but they have all the accessories with it. I even like, kind of like this with the recessed niche. Body sprays, selector, pretty cool. I mean, you could just put a, a metal one in there. Yeah, no, I haven't actually just silicone this in. It's like all stainless steel. <laughs> it's kind of hard to. It's kind of hard to go wrong with that. Oh, this is what I want for our. This would be perfect for that big shower. This would be perfect because we're gonna. It's a. It's a. A garage that has a, a gable kind of roof, and we were wanting to do it like a tub in the background and then have the shower kind of in front like this would be all incorporated with a soaking tub i was right and i think he was a star <laughs> and i just thought that this would be awesome for the, the the way that this room is set up because i'm almost i was struggling with the idea of how am i going to get a shower head and oh. your valve to turn on and all that Got stuff it. with the way it's all open Got it. this is like perfect so in. i mean i know this kind of looks like, like no i don't think so Do you think that that was Yes, absolutely. This is, yeah. I mean, it does kind of look like an outdoor shower. But I bet you this I thing works know. really it's well. Cool. I think that people would dig it. I mean, even that looks cool. Yeah. Yeah, these get all grimy and nasty, though. 
Yeah, but it would be nice even in a hotel. But hey, you know what? I mean, look, you got you got body sprays. You just hooked this up to your shower head. It's pretty freaking easy. Jeez, oh man, finally. This is one of the things that I hated about the Schluter drain is not having the sides of the tile all covered. So that that's the way it should be done so when you tile it, you don't see the edge. Now, I mean, that that's still gonna carry all the, that's gonna carry all the, the hair caught there though. But I do like the idea that that's all covered now. Yeah. So yeah, this is this is kind of better because you don't have anything resting underneath. Man, yeah, it's pretty nice. Now oh, there's Toto. Yeah, this is the better way to go because then this is like everything's incorporated. And you just got the plug in the background so you don't see any of these things. That's definitely the better way to go. The toilet seat actually looks like a normal seat too. Look at that remote. It's, yeah, this is bad. This is a better. This is a pretty nice design. It's a re-plumb. What's that? Re oh, re-plumb. Yeah. Okay, hey. Yeah, you too, man. Awesome. Guess you're the ambassador here now. Yeah. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, I just got the GoPro as well. Is that the Hero 12? Uh, it's 11. Oh, okay. 11. Always recording. This whole conversation is. is That's big. right. I know it's like, yeah. Sorry. No, no, no. And it's yeah, used. Like it's used stuff. as blackmail, so don't. <laughs> so this is ever, it hasn't been something I've tried yet. The quick drain system. So, so, have you seen their new thing? They just launched the bench one, so it's made. Oh. Bench, so now you don't have to wow, throw up the walls nice. anymore, right? Okay. So that's kind of dope, because then it, it, you can have the ability of like basically. Uh, Basically, like, you know, you could put this in any shower, right? You could even yeah. do like a 30, 30, uh, 32, 34. That's beautiful. Dude, That'd be really awesome. This is awesome. Because everyone will look at it and they're like, oh, we're worried about this or that. This takes that. A bench is awesome in shower. I love showers, yep. so I'm all about it. But yeah, I think this product's. Yeah. This, this is the one I'm most excited about. That I want really this in my house. Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. So if you guys don't know who this is, this is uh, Thomas T Y Custom. T I Y Custom, right? Yeah. yeah. Custom, yep. All right. I, I just noticed the logo, but yeah. uh, definitely check out his Instagram. He's got a lot of great content. Yeah. Instagram famous here at Odie. <laughs> That's right. So if you guys don't know who this is, this is RK Construction. Go to check out his Instagram channel. A lot of great tutorials, steps you everything through the process of a lot of the tiling installations, niches. I was about to say the same thing you know, about your channel. Well, I know, but <laughs> honestly, he makes me feel like I need to really keep up because his oh, tutorials are really that. great. So thank you. Check hey, it out. if you are here at, uh, at KBiz, come check out the OD booth. We're showing off the quick drain, uh, quick drain stuff. It's one of the best shower systems yeah. you're gonna see in the market here. Yeah, I'm excited to try it out. Yeah. Sure. So Hal's, Hal's is definitely what started off my entire bathroom remodeling career. Uh, because I started a little channel on there highlighting the bathrooms that I remodeled and it was it was like it grew like fire designers always go to this site to find ideas so if you're a contractor if you create a, a free profile on here you can start showcasing your content and get a lot of leads in your local area it was something that really I mean I'm serious had started my business and allowed me to grow uh, with them so Check out house.com. I, I can't say enough about it. <laughs> no, I was just telling him. I, I literally, video. I literally started out with it when I was a bathroom remodeler, and it really, like, I got so many leads from high-end designers to, exactly. like, it, it's what got me from a typical standard, like, I just want a new tub and surround to, I want this nice, you know, features in my bathroom, and, and I started doing forty, fifty thousand dollar bathrooms, uh, yeah. That's and then once you get a couple of those on house. It was just like, you know, I'm getting people calling me from Philadelphia. I mean, in Pittsburgh, but they were, people were calling me from, you know, 10 hours away asking if I could do things. Well, so. they see your work. It's on our website. They're always visiting the site, yep. looking for design and inspiration. They see reputable pros like you, and it's easy money. And it easy still money. is one of the best places to look at design features. And I, that's primarily what I felt most people were using it for. Where rather than going on Google Images, like shower with a bench, 
Uh, you could, you could fine tune the, the search on house and you're able to get a lot of the images that you're actually looking for. Right. You right. know, and then if, as a contractor, I would try to um, put the keywords within my description that, that highlight, you know, maybe, you know, handicap accessible or, or curbless shower. Curbless, I feel in some ways, house helped develop all the way through because it wasn't something in the year 2000, like no one really thought of or thought did. Of yeah. And now it's like, that's what everybody wants. Yeah. It's an interesting concept. Sometimes I feel like the LED lights are a little, little much. Look at that. No, they just have like really cool. Very cool. They have refrigerators. I want to go see the refrigerator. That's pretty cool. Talking about like next house getting a refrigerator that lasts. <laughs> Dude, we had to put one of these in. That is so cool. Now, does it feel well made? It does feel well made. Wow. Oh. Very cool. Nice. So Vigo is definitely one of my favorite shower door companies. I always put that on a lot of my shower door projects. Let's go see what they have new here. So they have some of the most well-built doors ever. Absolutely love this. I mean, they're just so smooth. Nice three eighths inch glass. I, I, I kind of like the opaqueness to this. No, oh, I even look at this shower faucet. That's pretty awesome. Wow. I just want to see what it looks like from the outside. Yeah. So it gives you like privacy. Yep. That's actually really, really Very nice. cool. Huh. <laughs> it's like a double slide door. Look how big that is. Wow. All right, so this is like perfect. If you need a lot of extra room in a small bathroom to get in here. Wow. That is so cool. That is really, really cool. I've never seen a one that works like that. That one's my number one. <laughs> this is one of my favorite recessed lights for bathroom renovations. It is so easy not having a ma major can light. You can just add a light anywhere you want pretty easily retrofit. So you'll see I, I put one of these in every one of my bathrooms. Very simple retrofit, already has the connections on them. I mean, if you ever had a can light, it's amazing how much easier this really is. I mean, this could be very cumbersome, you know, to put in the right location. This, you could pretty much put anywhere. Pretty awesome. And there it is. <laughs> Here's HydroBlock. So you guys all seen me install this. This is one of my favorite systems because it's a sealant application it's waterproof all the way through it has a cementitious exterior so this is definitely one of the most diy friendly types of systems out there and best of all it's light there's no dust and it's really easy to customize for your own shower so yeah that's pretty awesome low profile pans you can make them pretty easy to become curbless now this has a little bit of a wedge on here but they're really thin and you can make it work in most scenarios for a curbless shower. That's kind of a cool idea for the bench. I like that idea. That could be a good way to do it. I'm the guy that actually kind of started the whole program with HydroBlock. Oh, really? About 12 oh, years ago. Okay. And then, well, I'm in a huge fan of this type of product. I mean, yeah. um, you know, I it started out my career with bathroom remodeling is using a sealant application like this and easy customizable you know that's one of the biggest things with you know you, you can order a custom pan but it would take weeks to get it um, every bathroom remodel it's it's 60 and three quarter not 60 it's yeah. you know there's all types of different things and be able to customize it fit it and not have to worry about it leaking in any fashion is yeah that's why i love it look at that little blade that is awesome you got, you got, can you demonstrate on that that metal wheel again? Man, I'm never even seeing like that. Okay, so you just did that. My battery's dead. Okay. Uh, so it's the wall power too. What in the world? 
Here's the bigger one, the 46 grit. This is for your angle grinder. Unbelievable, <laughs> man. And, your porcelain and then you go right in the towel after that, and it's fun. That's super cool. That is cool. And hard or soft, it doesn't matter. Like a lot of times your, your diamond wheels won't cut soft things. Yeah. This will cut aluminum, it'll cut brass, it'll cut... Wow. Wow. Hard or soft, right down the side. Diamonds all the way down the side, so if you want to round off that tile... Dude, that's, that's amazing. That's amazing. All right, so we're gonna be doing a contest on installing a bidet toilet seat from Toto. And what's really awesome about this is how it's hidden. All the wires behind here look fantastic. You don't have any extra wires hanging out the back or the side of your toilet. So we'll see how quickly we can actually put this together. Hole number two, Steve. Give it up for Steve. Three, two, one, begin. Go ahead and be sure to put your force down to the deep Looks like Jack's getting very close. Timer, watch it. Oh, they're all getting very close. And Jack, stop. All right. Really? Yeah. Wow, man. Wow. Two minutes and 28 seconds. Two twenty-eight. That's incredible. All right. Pat. Wow. Keep going, keep going. Dude, that is, <laughs> that's amazing. Keep going, keep going. Oh. Keep going. All right. And stop on Steve. All right. <laughs> that's amazing, man. I can't believe you got it together. Three minutes and 16 seconds. That's impressive in and of itself. Good, good. How did, how did Jack do? All right, well, not too bad. Really? All right, Jack. Install. Very good, man. And Very good. <laughs> two minutes and 28 seconds. Wow. Two minutes and 28 seconds. Wow. The fastest we have seen. That's pretty awesome. Yes, here around, at, 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 <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> oh my God! Look at this toilet, babe. Babe. Yeah. That's the most unique toilet you ever seen in your life. I don't know. That's pretty crazy. So here's Ventiques. How's it going? How you doing? Good. Nick? Good to see you. How are you doing today? Great, man. Great. Awesome. So we just demonstrated this. These are really awesome. If you want a wow factor for your bathroom, add one of these. It gives a really beautiful look. Really easy to install. Really well made. Um, and yeah, I mean, it really made that bathroom I just did look, cool. look fantastic. Yeah. yeah, that one was really nice. Yeah, if you want one of these, uh, use uh, my code, bathroom remodel, get 15% off. But this is uh, definitely something to add a little bit of flavor to your bathroom. This is Sika. This is a company that I've been really wanting to check out. I see a lot of my towel friends using a lot of their products. And one of them specifically is the self leveler. Now I'm a big proponent of using self levelers. It just makes tiling so much easier because you get a nice flat surface especially if you're using smaller tiles. It's almost imperative to do that. And if you're adding heated flooring, this is one way to go about doing it. So self-leveler, I definitely need to try out this product. Uh, I also know they have their sealants, which has been around forever and always been well trusted. So a lot of their non-sag polyurethane sealants are great for waterproofing and having lost, you know, last, long lasting type of sealants. So Sika, I hope to work with you on a couple of projects. Yeah. Based quickly in Zurich, Switzerland, USA Division in Lyndhurst, New Jersey. I'm James Rogers, and welcome to the Seeker Network. <laughs> You, he my loves favorite, favorite thing. you guys so much. Panasonic <laughs> Vent fans, I, I know you've seen me install hundreds of these, and I'm always excited about them because, I mean, it is the most important thing to add to your bathroom renovation is getting airflow to get moisture out. Panasonic will do it because it, it's nice and quiet, efficient, and really easy to install. It's the best. So that's it for IBS, International Builder Show. It was definitely an awesome show. Honestly, it's still overwhelming on how many places I still got completely lost. You know, finding all the different locations and different things. But I tell you what, if you are like in the home industry, 
building a new house, doing any type of home remodeling. I mean, you have every aspect of building there with all the different, you know, I mean, it's just amazing. So I really had a great time looking forward to coming back and discovering more and more uh, products that are gonna help me plan, learn, and build uh, bathrooms. So yeah, thanks so much for following along. Leave a comment down below if you went there or if you're ever interested in going to IBS.